Hello, my name is George, and in this video, we're diving into a comparison of two of the biggest names in project management software, Monday.com versus Asana. Both tools are designed to help teams manage tasks, collaborate better, and stay on top of their projects. But which one is the right fit for your needs? By the end of this video, you'll have a clear understanding of how these platforms stack up when it comes to task management, analytics, integrations, user experience, and pricing. And before we dive in, a quick disclaimer, some links in the description are affiliate links. This means I may earn a small commission if you make a purchase through them at no extra cost to you. This helps me support my channel. Now, let's get started. Task management. Let's start with task management, which is probably the most important feature of any project management software. This is all about how well you can create, organize, and track tasks for your team. Monday.com is super flexible here. It lets you customize your workspace with colorful boards, different views like timelines and Kanban boards, and options to track time on tasks. You can even assign tasks to multiple people, which is great if several team members are working on the same thing. Plus, their templates make setting up projects really easy. Now, on the other hand, Asana shines when it comes to how detailed you can get with tasks. You can break tasks into subtasks, create dependencies so one task can start until another one is done, and organize everything neatly with sections and tags. While Asana's task management tools are slightly more structured, Monday.com is easier to set up and use right away. It really comes down to whether you value detailed control or quick customization. Now let's talk about analytics, how well the software can show you what's happening in your projects and help you make informed decisions. Analytics are especially important when you're managing complex projects or need to keep track of progress across multiple teams. In this category, Monday.com has a noticeable advantage. It offers over 40 dashboard widgets that allow you to create highly customized reports. These widgets let you track everything from project progress to team workloads in a way that's easy to visualize. Monday.com's system called MondayDB is specifically built to handle large and complex projects, ensuring your data is always accessible and organized. If you love having granular control over how your data is displayed, you'll probably appreciate the flexibility and depth that Monday.com provides. Asana, on the other hand, takes a more straightforward approach to analytics. Each project gets its own dashboard with six types of charts, including bar graphs, line graphs, and donut charts. These are great for providing a quick overview of your project status, but they lack the advanced customization options that Monday.com offers. For example, you can't mix and match data sources or build highly detailed reports. Now, that being said, Asana's simplicity might appeal to teams that just need a basic snapshot of their projects without diving too deep into data visualization. It's also worth noting that Asana's analytics features are easy to use, so even teams with minimal experience in reporting can quickly get the hang of it. So overall, if you are a data enthusiast who thrives on creating detailed dashboards and extracting insights, Monday.com will be your go-to. But if you're looking for something simple and functional without too many bells and whistles, Asana's analytics will do the job just fine. Next up, integrations. These are what allow your project management tool to connect with other software your team might already be using, like Slack or Google Drive or Microsoft Teams. Asana is a clear winner in this category. It offers over 200 integrations, covering tools for communication, data tracking, and more. It also includes integrations in all its paid plans, which means you don't have to pay extra to connect it to your favorite apps. This makes it super versatile, especially for teams that already rely on multiple tools. Monday.com has about 70 integrations, which isn't bad, but it's more limited compared to Asana. Plus, some of Monday.com's integrations are locked behind their higher tier plans, and the number of times you can use them each month is capped. If connecting your project management tool to other apps is critical for your team, Asana is probably the way to go. User experience. User experience, or how easy it is to actually use the software, 
is another big factor to consider. Both Monday.com and Asana do really well here, but they cater to slightly different preferences. Monday.com is highly visual. Its colorful boards and drag and drop features make it simple to navigate, even if you're new to project management tools. It's a great choice for teams that want something intuitive and adaptable. You can customize just about everything, which is perfect for teams that have unique workflows. Asana, meanwhile, keeps things simple and straightforward. Its interface is more minimalist, which makes it easy to focus on what matters most, your tasks. It's especially useful for teams managing multiple projects at once because it's so organized. While Monday.com is more customizable, Asana's simplicity makes it slightly easier to master. Pricing. Now for pricing, which is always a big consideration. Both Monday.com and Asana offer free plans, but they're pretty different in what they include. Asana's free plan supports up to 10 team members and gives you access to basic project and task management tools. It's great for small teams or startups who are just getting started and don't have a big budget. Monday.com's free plan, however, is much more limited. It only allows two users and three boards, which might not be enough for most teams. On the plus side, Monday.com's paid plan start at just $9 per user per month, which is slightly cheaper than Asana's paid plans that start at $10.99 per user per month. But currently, it's on promotion for only $8.5 per month. So if you're working with a tight budget and need more functionality than a free plan can offer, Asana's lower starting price at promo might be more appealing. For teams looking at the higher tier plans, Monday.com's pro plan costs $19 per user per month and offers advanced features like time tracking, private boards, and more automation options. Asana's equivalent plan is priced at $24.99 per user per month, but it includes custom automation and project portfolios. And yes, it's currently on promo and costs only $19.21 monthly. So while Monday.com is a bit more affordable based on the original price, Asana offers more value for teams that need those extra features. Which is right for you? So which tool should you choose? Honestly, it depends on your team's priorities. Monday.com is great for teams that value flexibility and customization. It's easy to use, visually appealing, and packed with features like time tracking, colorful boards, and powerful data visualization tools. However, its integrations are more limited and some features are locked behind higher tier plans. Now, on the other hand, Asana excels in task management, offering detailed control with subtasks, dependencies, and workflows. It also has a much larger library of integrations and a more generous free plan, making it ideal for teams that need to connect with other tools or have a smaller budget. That being said, Asana's pricing for advanced features is higher and its interface, while clean, might feel slightly cramped when managing very complex projects. Both platforms have strengths and weaknesses, so the choice really comes down to what matters most for your team. Now, if you are ready to try out Monday.com or Asana, check out the links in the description of this video to get started. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time.